saddle sores. They can ruin your day, ruin your ride, and also ruin you. I've been there. I felt the pure pain of getting a saddle sore. I need to get a new saddle. So here are my top tips to prevent you guys from getting a sore ass. Right, let's start off with an obvious one, your saddle. Now you've got three contact points that connects you to your bike. The one that's gonna take the most about weight is your saddle. So getting a saddle that fits is absolutely paramount. Now before you got into cycling, you probably looked at these razor thin hard saddles with sympathy for the poor riders that have to sit on them. But in actual fact, one of these is a lot more comfier than say one of these, yep the soft, comfy, big saddles. But what do I mean about saddles and how it fits correctly? Us cyclists sit on sit bones. The scientific word for sit bones is this. Now we need to know our measurement between those two sit bones. Now you can do so by going to your bike shop and you can sit on a gel pad and measure between your two sit bones. Now you need to know this two measurements to get the perfect saddle. If you go too big, it might be uncomfortable when you start pedaling. And if you go too thin, well then you might be sitting on your soft tissue. And trust me, that's painful. Yeah, <laughs> I've been there. I need to get a new saddle. So you found your perfect saddle. The next really important piece of equipment that is gonna help you keep you comfortable on your bike is a pair of cycling shorts. Now you want a nice snug fitting shorts, not too tight because we don't want to cut off any blood flow and not too loose because we don't want our shorts flapping in the wind. But something that is going to keep your chamois in the right position when you're pedaling your bike. Yeah, I'm talking about this part of your shorts. Now this is designed to keep close to your skin. Yeah, I said it before and I'm going to say it again. Go commando, get rid of your box shorts or your pants and ride with just these. Now finding a chamois that fits you is gonna be absolutely imperative, but there are so many out there, so how do you know what fits? So the best thing to do is go out and try a load of different shorts and just, yeah, see what works for you, I guess. This one's my personal favorite. Saddle sores can occur from pressure in the wrong areas or from the wrong saddle. But they can also occur from chafing. Yeah, so to prevent this, you can use some chamois cream. So the good thing about chamois cream is it prevents any friction buildup. Now you can apply this directly to your chamois or directly to your skin. The one thing I would say though is, yeah, don't double dip. You know what I'm thinking. Hold on mate, just one minute. Chamois cream on. Oh. It may be super obvious, but it's worth mentioning. The best thing to do if you've been in the saddle for a while is to select a bigger gear and stand up out of the saddle for a few pedal revs. This will give you a bit of a relief and hopefully will give your bum the rest it needs before you can sit back in the saddle, relax and carry on smashing out the miles. Another way you can prevent yourself from getting a sore undercarriage is getting the right saddle height. If your saddle's too high, your pelvis will rotate on top and you'll find it really uncomfortable and it will give you a sore undercarriage. You're looking for the perfect saddle height, meaning your pelvis is nice and level and your weight is distributed through the pedals, the saddle, and also your handlebars. The last thing to think about is saddle tilt. So the best way to do this is by fixing your bike to a turbo trainer where it's nice in a stationary position. Now ride it as you would on the road in a position that you're comfortable with and have a play around with the tilt, nose down or nose up, and find what fits you best. After all, it's personal preference. I like mine nice and level. I hope that is level. So my work is done. I hope I've prevented you guys from getting a sore ass and for being in the position I've been in. So on that note, well, I better put my tips into practice.
chamois cream, good shorts. Now a long ride. <laughs> so find a chamois that works for you.